This guy went over 600 miles per hour, earning himself the title of fastest man alive. But did he survive? John Paul Stapp was a physician in the Air Force who was fascinated by speed and the effects of G-force on the human body. G-force is the measurement of acceleration due to gravity. On Earth, gravity causes us to accelerate towards the center of the planet at 32 feet per second squared, which is a force of 1 G. But if you hop onto a roller coaster or into an airplane, the increased acceleration will cause more G-force and perceived weight on your body. So how much G-force is safe? In the 1940s, it was assumed that pilots could only withstand up to 18 Gs, but Stapp believed humans could withstand more, much more. To test his theory, Stapp built a rocket sled that propelled down a track at hundreds of miles an hour. At first he used dummies, but eventually he tested it on himself. During his last run, Stapp hit 632 miles an hour in five seconds and stopped in just over one second, subjecting himself to a whopping 46.2 Gs and making his body weigh around 7,700 pounds for that brief moment. Stapp's trials led to some injuries like broken ribs, a hernia, a shattered wrist, hemorrhages in the eye, a fractured tailbone, and temporary blindness. But Stapp survived, and he later went on to work with NASA as well as on some of the first tests for airbags and cars. 